Hi there, today I'm going to be trying a wine from Bodegas Tradition. This is a uh, sherry producer that has its origins back in 1650 um, when the Rivero family founded their, their bodega. Uh, they sold up in 1991 but immediately after uh, they, they started a new project which became Bodegas Tradition where they focus on really high quality sherries and made in a very traditional style and a very traditional uh, methods. Um, so we're going to be giving this a go. It's a VORS Oloroso. This is the, I mean the colour on it is, is just beautiful. Um, and <clears throat> we're going to be giving it a shot. The Solera um, goes back to 1850. So you're looking at you know traces of a really, really ancient wine there with the youngest wines in it being um, I think about 17 years old. Wow. So, the, the, you're getting polished wood, you're getting caramelized nuts, you're getting raisins, you're getting that sort of lovely oxidized dried fruit uh, aroma that you would you would normally get. It's 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 really beautiful. That 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 polish element comes through so so much. And um, so the best way of describing it is this is the this is the smell the smell of this this wine is what whiskey producers that age their whiskies in sherry are trying to steal that's that's what this smells like um, that that all of those aromas that you normally get with a, a lovely Speyside whiskey that's been put into sherry that's what you're getting from this it just it is just beautiful Dry, beautiful balance, lovely acidity, very fresh, mouth-wateringly fresh. Actually, it's 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 a stunning bottle of wine. Um, you're getting those nutty flavors, but these t this time it's more salted cashew nuts and and that sort of flavor. Then you're getting that really dried fruit, and we're talking we're not we're talking about no residual liquid in 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 the the fruit. It's it's like licking a prune. That that dry fruit flavor. Um, that saline character, that saltiness is there. Mm. It's just, wow. It is just beautiful. We're doing a deal on this. Uh, I think it's 63 pounds a bottle down to I think 58. But remember that these whiskies, that's what we, we, see, that's, the, that's how my brain is thinking. These wines, um, will last a year. Once you open them, they will easily last a year. So don't worry about it being something that you think you've got to drink over the next week or so. This is this is something that really um, can last a long time. So look at it as a long-term investment. Um, as I said, we're doing a deal. It's, I think it's 63 down to 58 for a bottle. Um, and it, it, it is just a sublime, sublime sherry, really. It's, 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 it's perfection. Absolutely brilliant. Um, 96 pointer for this um it's awesome it's really good um um yeah comments below please we get a lot of views we love them thank you for watching we really do appreciate it but uh, we'd love it if you'd tell us if you tried these wines what your favorite sherry is please do engage with us we'd really love to to hear from you hear about your favorite wines and your 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 drinking experiences with 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 maybe the wine that we're having today or something similar to it if you, if you have an Oloroso sherry you like um please do comment um i'll see you tomorrow